All right, I'm back. Hopefully that cleared up issues. I say hopefully. Okay, well, it sent me back a bit, but that's okay. I don't know why I have all three of these ones just being set here. In any case. Okay, so there might still be some issues. What I'm trying to do here is whenever the murderer is stuck in a position for more than half a second, then uh, it will go ahead and I go to its last touch node. Basically, whatever uh, node the murderer has touched last, that's the one it would go to. And when it goes over a second, meaning that it couldn't get to its last touch node, and without touching any other nodes in its path, then it tries to find the closest node. I 
actually, there's one thing I really should do here. And it's to keep track of this timer. I changed one small little character, but you know, things like that do have an effect and are often the source of my errors. So, perhaps it's best to test it. Also, I just noticed this should not be that. That's quite possibly why it's never going up. Now, it could be going up, in which case I'd be surprised. But I don't I don't think it is. Especially because I don't think the murderer ever goes to zero zero. Okay, so this is still working with the old, uh, I guess, stale code. Debug stuck timer is zero. And as you can see, debug pause X and debug pause Y stays the same. Uh, it is not progressing. Just to uh, confirm that they are, uh, the murderer is where I think the murderer is. Yep. Okay. So I'm just going to close that one out. I'm going to something like that refresh it and because uh, this part did change be, uh, but it was already compiling so I don't think it saw it Uh, okay. I... Oh, wait, it compiled already. I prefer the non-emoji smiley, the uh, one with the semicolon and, uh, or uh, parentheses and semicolon. 
That is not going to make sense on YouTube since I don't save chat. But at least I have a visitor today. Yay! I'm sorry, I prefer it you you take that back. It's not hideous. Hmm. Look, it, you can put the parentheses wherever you want. On either side, it still makes sense. Is it that you typed in the parentheses one way and then it just turned into the uh, into the emoji? Because if you meant to send the parentheses one way, then I guess that would have made, made sense. But either way, they're both as good. Just not... I don't know, I feel like that's a good thing, though. Alright, let's see. This is not where it should be. Alright. Something's going horribly, horribly wrong. I'm guessing it has to do with, probably should change this code so that way it works a bit better. I'm going to do something like that just so that way if it gets unstuck for it tiny moment that it won't entirely undo the timer. Well, I can find the murderer. The problem is that I know where the murderer is. The one thing I'm trying to do is trying to prevent myself from finding the murderer so easily. They should not be sticking in one place. That is my problem. Variables. Value of a variable. So that would make a lot of sense. Ah, that's actually the one I need. That one is much better. The uh, the bracket gives kind of a, a robotic feel to it.
Okay, yeah, I guess no one can technically smile with perfect right angles. But it's still, like... I, I like it. I like I like the bracket. The one with the bracket. Perhaps. Perhaps I am. This key over here. I should probably just get rid of the doors at the moment. In fact, now I think about it, I don't actually have to open these doors. Since I'm just trying to get this key. All right, let's see. Stuck here. The stuck timer is zero. Perhaps I am the, uh, the white cube murderer after all. I mean, if it intelligence is anything to go by, then certainly I do share a lot of that with this particular stay right by the door murderer that I'm trying to get to not do that. Okay, so what am I doing wrong here? Could be something. This is what your monster emoji looks like. Except the spacing is wrong. I'm sorry, what? Not entirely sure if I follow what you're trying to tell me. Okay. Okay. Uh, uh, <laughs> that is a that is a hideous. Uh, well, I would say that's more of an emoticon. I'm not entirely sure. Then again, I might be caught up in names of what one thing is, because I'm pretty sure emoji is. Well, it's technically under the hood, it's usually more than one character. Uh, when displayed, it's displayed as if it were one character. Whereas this is usually multiple characters. And thus I classify it as an uh, emoticon. In any case, it seems like this is at least working reasonably well. And yes, that is hideous.
but that is a bit of an exaggeration. Okay, so I guess that's that for murder movement, but I gotta re-implement the code over here. Bold of you to assume that I'm educated enough to know the difference, smart boy. How TF is it an exaggeration? It looks exactly the same. You take that back. They do not look exactly the same. One looks just a little bit robotic, but still it has the same charm of the original uh, smiley emoticon. And the other one is is indeed a horrible abomination. That is an exaggeration. You will die on this hill? Well, okay then. But you will die incorrectly. That is to say, you'll die being incorrect. Just do that. I have to manually replace the or place the two at the end. Okay. Okay. This should help with the blue murderer too. You know what? You know what? Even if you do learn to program just to make all my, uh, all my smile brackets, my bracketed smiles look like that extreme exaggeration, I will still use it. In fact, I would, I would ramp up my usage of that to an unprecedented degree. Wait, did I change this correctly? Yeah, I changed this correctly. And I don't even care if it had the absolutely horrid spacing. I would still use it. You cannot prevent me from using semicolon bracket. That is like my go-to when I want a smiley face. The other one, kind of like the uh, uh, the one with the uh, parenthesis, that one, it looks like it's just missing a nose. But then the other one,
the other one, all right, looks charming. All right, you just you just hold on. would struggle to pour water out of a boot with instructions on the heel wouldn't you okay look if if it was programming if it was a if it was instructions written in like c++ absolutely but here's the thing the bracket smile is still the perfect perfect smile above all else I'm going to have to edit this video for context because I am taking screenshots of the chat with my phone but I will put it in there to make my point Need to look at Murderer 2 for the Oh right, I don't have the debug thing for Murderer 2. You know what? If it is my, uh, if I did ye my last haw on this, then it was a good thing to to ye my last haw on. Should also probably copy the other code. This part. You will have to. There is no way around this. If you want to go ahead and say that that looks like that abomination, I will fight you on this. This looks about correct. First, I've already made all the points that I needed to, to entirely support my side. Alright? You're just incorrect. You are straight up incorrect. There has been almost never before a statement that was as untrue as the thing you just said in my chat. Colon bracket 
is a very good smile. Uh, that one is, uh, I, I, don't, I don't really care too much for that one, but it's maybe a little bit better than the uh, original uh, colon parenthesis. Is the colon squiggly bracket, or even the semicolon squiggly bracket. Those ones are okay. But still, not above the uh, colon bracket. Not where I expected, but that's what I was expecting. This did not to expect. Right, I think I think I think that's all that I need to do for murder improvements. How much time do I have left? Ah. You know what? You know what? You bet that I am an OO boy, not an OO boy. I will I will type in chat what kind of boy I am. There. I use accents and also don't use a W. I just disagree with you on literally everything that you are saying. How could I come to an agreement with you? You're just saying incorrect things. Like if there was a, if there was a fundamental rule of the universe, right? You'd expect something like, oh, uh, conservation of energy or something like that no the first thing the first rule of the internet is that you are incorrect on this well do you represent my deepest fears well then i don't know what to say that uh what to say to that. Possibly other than you are correct to have me as a fear. Mainly if you're watching me. You might lose some intelligence. Nonetheless, on this particular point, you may gain some perspective about First rule of the internet is don't stand country music and Miles 54, apparently. You know what? I can agree with that rule, but I cannot agree with you. So, almost everything you've said so far, incorrect. What was I doing again? All right, so I have a uh, blue murderer. And white murderer. 
working properly. And apparently this guy is getting joy of uh, me being gotten to. You know what? That's okay. That's okay. If it brings you joy, all right. But you're still wrong. Any case, do I have a display for collected items? I don't believe so. <clears throat> Light code. Okay, first, I, I don't know if there's anyone else particularly who feels strongly about, uh, uh, about colon bracket, but you know what? You decided to wage a war that is over the right way and stupidity by saying it's not the right way. Colon some, uh, or... Colon bracket is like the best way to transmit a smile in in text form. Colon parentheses looks like you you don't have enough uh enough space between the the parentheses and the colon to. Okay, but you're one person arguing with me. You say, what are you going to do? You and your three subscribers? Yes, but you're only arguing against me alone, so it's one-on-one. -on -one. I would I would ask you to make some good points, but I'm not entirely sure if you could. There might just not be any good points to be made. Then do give good points for why anything other than col or colon bracket. Give any good point for that. And I will fight you on it. You started this war. That is why I have to do it to you. That's why he had to do it to him. Do I have an image already prepared for it? I don't think I do. Do I already have something in here for it? 
all I'm asking is that you bring up a good point for your uh for your case. If you can't do that, then I have nothing to fight against. Except for one person making an assertion that they cannot provide any evidence for. I have key display, but I don't have valuable display, so... What? Oh. I guess I do have valuable display. I just didn't see it. All right, let's see. What do I have for a key display? I am really not using the A-Sprite stuff uh, folder that I set outside. If you read right to left, your emoji should reflect that. Thus, eyes then mouth with the tips curved towards the eyes. I mean, look, it's 90 degrees rotated from how you naturally look at things, so it really doesn't matter. It doesn't matter which way it's 90 degrees rotated. So it's just key A, key B, and let's see. So I can just, whoop. Well, no, 180 degrees would be uh, with the items on the bottom and the uh, bracket on, or the uh, small bracket curly brace or parenthesis on top. It's 90 degrees rotated from where, like, your head is. <clears throat> Yet the transparent part isn't showing up. Isn't the uh, transparent black part showing up? Hmm.
90 degrees is two dots with the bracket below slash or above. Yeah, that's what I'm saying, is that uh, no matter if you go put the bracket on the left or the right, it will still be 90 degrees rotated from where the bracket would normally be on a person, which is their mouth. 90 degrees in either direction. Do I need to give you a, a visual demonstration of this? Okay, so look. Here are the eyes. Here's the uh, smile. All right. Currently, zero degrees rotation. This, 90 degrees. And this, 90 degrees in the other way. This is very simple. So it's 90 degrees rotated in either way, either this way or this way. It doesn't matter which way you prefer. It's just that this too close. It doesn't feel that close when you have a bracket. This feels perfect. And you know what? This also looks natural. But parenthesis way too close what are you gonna do throw space in there might work but that's like a third character that you have to put in there whereas you could have the space efficient and not unnatural looking except for I guess like the corners but that that's like a little bit of charm not un not unnatural looking pleasing to the eyes bracket the perfect smile. Go ahead and make your point. It's your move now. Okay, look, I'm not saying that the brackets aren't necessarily closer. I'm just saying that the distance when you're using a bracket still feels right. Whereas when you're using a parenthesis, it feels cla claustrophobic. It's probably having to do with the fact that... Uh, before you go ahead and consider that, all of this distance between the eye and uh, the thing, right? This, charming. This, 
looks awful. Okay, maybe it was my drawing skills there, but... This? I don't know, I guess maybe this one's particularly okay. But it still feels a little too close for comfort. It, again, it may be technically closer, but it doesn't feel that way. See this bottom of uh, bottom part of the mouth, this part, right? That distance. Whereas you do that with a that. This distance doesn't feel so, I, I mean, again, I'm, I'm human and I'm drawing these kind of inaccurately, but still feels a little bit closer. And I still don't know why this isn't exporting with the transparency that I wanted to. This, this has transparency, this one does not. You know what? As I see it, Okay, look here. It's supposed to be transparent when I export it. In here, it's transparent. There we go. That's what I was looking for. Are you trying to insult me with cheese? 
And if you absolutely do want to call me that, I'll look my timers up. If you absolutely do want to call me that, I have no problem with colon bracket. It's much better than colon parentheses. I'm going to continue a bit longer. Let's see. Collection opening, that's what I want. And I admire the fact that you see my position as incorrect despite the fact that it is correct sure why not all right but i am going to check out for the day thank you for being here uh this will be available on youtube there's links in uh my twitch uh Better. that's going to be it for today thank you for stopping by until i see you again this will be goodbye